In round two, our experts will choose from seven questions, scaling in difficulty from one to seven. And you better believe those $7 questions are going to be really hard. They'll get two questions each, and for each one, they can either answer or push. But if they push and their opponent answers the question correctly, it's the opponent who gets the money. Now, bear in mind, our experts can't lose any money in this round, but if they play smart, they can stop their opponents from making much money. Danny, you have the lowest score currently, so we're going to start with you. Okay, $2. $2 on the lower end. What are you going to do with that? I'm going to give it to my man Jerome over here. Jerome, your $2 question. In what year was Hong Kong ceded to the English? Oh, God. The island of Hong Kong in 1842. That is correct. Okay, Noreen, Here let's get go. a question from you. Okay, the magic number Whoa. seven. The hardest hitting question Whoa. in round two. Big what are you going to do? Big choices. You know what? I'm a big girl and I came to play a big game, so. Okay, I I'll like the courage. Mm, nice. <laughs> let's see it. Your $7 question and a chance to jump into the lead. In a 2000 interview with Mojo Magazine, what two things did Al Barnes say had fueled his desire to prove to everyone that Blur were worth it? The Blur and Oasis battle, and I'm not sure. Unfortunately, that's incorrect. <laughs> the two answers we were looking for were the band Suede and America. Whoa. So, Jerome, your turn to swipe us up a number. Okay, five, another high value question. Well, if Noreen doesn't mind losing, I don't mind losing. I'm gonna go for it too. <laughs> okay, your second question for the round. For five dollars, what system was used in Imperial China to select the best administrative officials for the state bureaucracy? It's called the examination system, Imperial Examination. <laughs> That's correct, the Imperial Examination. Let's we'll see what happens. Six bucks. Six dollars. This is an opportunity for you. You can either answer it or you can pass it to Noreen. I think I gotta take it at this point. Okay, so. your $6 question coming at you. What actress appears as herself in Kevin and Jenny's Mommy and Me class? Uh, uh, Jay Cutler is what? Kristen Cavalier. That's correct, oh another gosh. good choice in round two for you. Here it comes. Okay. Ooh, one the dollar. The little one dollar question. What are you gonna do with that? I think this has Danny written all over it. Okay, a wise <laughs> pass, a common <laughs> pass. <laughs> and a one dollar question for Danny on the league. What recurring character is a urologist specializing in genital reconstruction? I'd be uh, Shiva. That's herself. correct. The namesake of the trophy. Yeah. So one dollar for you. <laughs> okay. So Jerome, if you can swipe us up a number, this is sure. going to be for Noreen. Four. The four dollar. The only remaining question at this point. Nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, Noreen, your four dollar question. Yes. An orchestra from what country is featured on the song "Out of Time"? Morocco. That's correct. Nice. Four dollars for you. <laughs> so after an eventful second round, we are still in a very close competition here. Let's see what happens in round three. 